Hello friends, in this video we will implement sorting on HTML grid. We will be using Ajax action links and partial views which will not load the entire page but only grid based on the sorting criteria. We would like to watch the previous 5 parts of the playlist wherein we have explained how to render a simple grid in MVC5 with code first approach. Add edit delete with the HTML grid MVC5 and we have also implemented paging with that same grid. And in the previous part, that is part 5, we have implemented sorting in MVC5. And in this part, we are going to implement sorting using Ajax, Ajax action links and partial views. So that the entire page is not loaded, only the grid is being loaded when the sorting is initiated. And if you watch the previous parts, we'll be having the flow with the application. And we are going to use the same project to demonstrate this video. So let's go through the project now we have the employee class which is the model of our class we have grid context class which is an editing from DB context class and we have created employees DB set and we are using code first approach we have home controller which is responsible for all the operations and we have a sorting demo function which is responsible for sorting similarly we have a sorting demo view over which we have implemented implemented sorting in the previous example now if you see through the UI so this is the basically grid and on clicking off the ID we are sorting the grid and you can notice the entire page is being loaded on clicking the link so we have to prevent this and in order to achieve only updation of grid without loading the entire page we need to use Ajax, Ajax action links and partial views so let's start with the partial view now uh, this is the table which is we which we want to update on click off the links or when the sorting is initiated so we are going to cut this part so we are going to cut this table part and we are going to include it in a partial view so let me add a partial view so I'm going to name it as employee grid Ajax and inside this partial view I'm going to accept a model of type I enumerable so that we can iterate over these employees and render grid rows and my type is of employees and inside the sorting demo from where we have cut this table we are going to render this partial view so that when this page is loaded the grid will be rendered so I'm going to use partial helper so the, for this helper we have to provide the name of the partial view to call so employee grid ajax is my partial view name and model going to pass the model so this view basically receives the employee model enumerable employees the same we are going to pass it to partial view okay so if we render the if we refresh the page so there is no effect the page will remain the same as we are rendering it through the partial view okay if I comment this partial view the view will be blank okay so let's uncomment it now we are going to move move towards second part of our implementation and in the second part we are going to make changes to our controller now as we are rendering it through the partial view we cannot use this action result method because this method returns a view but we are going to return a partial view so we'll create a sorting demo action result method separately so let's create it public action result method and we are going to name it as sorting demo and we are going to return a view from this method with list of employees okay and we are going to rename this method as sorting demo ajax and uh, at the end of this method we are going to return a partial view which we have created 
so we are going to use partial view method and we need to provide the name of the partial view so we have added employee grid ajax partial view and we are going to pass the list of employees okay so now the second part is also done for the implementation that is changes to the home controller then in the final part we are going to make changes to this partial view now currently you can see we have html.action links so we are going to replace it with ajax.action links so that an ajax post will be submitted to the controller and the content will be rendered without loading the entire page so we say action link the first parameter it accepts is the id the next parameter is the action name so the action name on which we are going to post is sorting demo ajax the third parameter is the route values yes we are going to have route value that is the sorting criteria and for this the sorting criteria will be coming from viewback.id and then the fourth parameter is the ejects option which is very important and we are going to have we are going to post the next is the insertion mode the insertion mode is replace and finally updated target id so this updated target id gives the value or give we can provide the value of the container inside which we are going to update so sorting demo i am giving sorting div okay now what happens when the ajax post is when you click on this link ajax post will be sent to the partial view method in the controller that is this and uh, this will return a partial view and this partial view will be replaced that is insertion mode dot replace in the target id that is sorting div so inside this div the partial view will be rendered asynchronously so in order to have that div we need to create a div so we are going to create a div here and we are going to set its id attribute the same value we have provided here so that is sorting div okay similarly i need to update all the links so i have already have the html so i'm just going to copy replace it so i'm replacing the entire tr okay so you can check the all the values are proper and now we are also done with the third part so let's run the application i know i am missing one thing and so let me experience it first and then i'll tell you which important one more thing is pending to achieve the sorting with ajax links now if you click on the id oh uh oh there is something problem sorting demo partial okay i think we are so our partial view name is sorting demo ajax and we have wrong name inside this so let me replace it with sorting demo ajax okay let me refresh the view again and if you click on the id you'll notice the partial view is rendered on a separate link or separate as a separate view instead of rendering as a part of this grid inside the same view so this is because the view is not implementing the ajax behavior now to achieve the ajax behavior we need to reference script files that is the jquery file and unobtrusive ajax file so this is important in achieving the ajax behavior without these files you will not be able to achieve the ajax behavior and there's one more key in the config that is unobtrusive javascript enable that has to be true in order to achieve the ajax behavior 
so after so I have reference the file security files now let me refresh the view again and if I click on the ID you can see the grid has been so grid is ordered based on the sorting criteria and the page is not being loaded and everything is done using Ajax okay so this is how you can achieve sorting with Ajax links and partial views without loading the entire page I hope you like this video. Thank you friends.